Okay, welcome to the Culinary Vegetable Institute. Uh, today we're gonna walk through a, uh, uh, one of these home delivery boxes and farmer's on his way. What we'd like to do is really get into this and, and somewhat you know, demystify this, make it easier, more approachable, and really ultimately fun, because um, it is. Now I've been living off of the, hey farmer, how's it going? Hey chef. Good, good morning. So we at the Chef's Garden have also been really living off of these boxes at, uh, at home. It's really cool. Yeah, for sure. It gives us a good, you know, window into the world of, you know, what, what people are dealing with. And right. It's, it's right. so fun. Um, so we're well, gonna, you know, and I mean, and one of the things we hear is that the boxes are intimidating, and I'm not a chef, right. and what are we gonna do with this? I don't know how to, and I think that that's really kind of gonna be fun. We're gonna open these up. You're gonna create a dish, a chef-driven dish, and you know, I'm working guy. I obviously don't make all the right choices <laughs> on my eating. But uh, I'm really, Mary and I have been really trying to focus on eating a little bit uh, healthier. So these boxes have went well to that as well. Yeah. yeah so, I mean, exactly. I'm not even going to turn a stove on for mine. Oh, I'm going to pop some of this out. And, you got to cook something. You know, a lot, the reality is a lot of us are in a hurry. You know, we got to get in. We got to get something to eat, get back to work. Right. And so I guess I want to kind of, from my perspective, break this down and show even a guy like me can... Make it happen. <laughs> Sustain <laughs> myself. <laughs> what do we got? Uh, I just pulled out, looks like some greens. Oh, uh, great. Herbs, microgreens, and flowers. Always on top. Lettuces look great. Still nice and cold. Oh, oh that looks beautiful. Cool. What else? Potatoes, a big day. Oh, some kale up. They're hard to come by. Do you need carrots? I might, I don't know. I mean, I'm, I'm gonna, gonna wing it. <laughs> see what we've got to work with here. Beets, sweet potatoes, and, uh, and potatoes. There's a lot going on. You know, I, I think I would like to approach this like, you know, like I do at home, really. Um, we're just like, sort of a mix of all the ingredients in a pan, just cooked hard um, and dressed well and, and transferred to a plate. It's not too complicated, but it's right. uh, really delicious. You know, they say color is health. I try and work a little color in and, you know, even if I'm not gonna eat everything exactly right, I'm gonna try and get some greens and some, some kale and some veg into my, whatever I'm eating, I'm gonna try and get some of that in, even if I'm in a hurry. Good. I mean, we, we pull them out of the earth, they get washed, they, mm -hmm. need a, they need a kitchen wash, but we bring them a lot of times, Mary and I bring them out of the bag and we use them. Yeah. And wow, that looks beautiful. Yeah, you guys have really done all the hard work at this point. I mean, all we've got to do is like, just get it on a plate. Not a, tell about the, the quality of these ingredients. They really don't need a whole lot of work. You know, it's not something we need to you know, spend, spend a lot of time on. They're just delicious really are. Well, the big thing for me is I want to emphasize, you know, you can throw something healthy together, you can get something down and get back to work. And <laughs> yeah, Six or maybe seven times out of ten when we're cooking at home, this is how we take care of it. Just, whatever vegetables we've got, you know, you, you empty out your pockets of, of carrots and beets from walking through the field. <laughs> um, any greens, and we'll often serve this with like rice or um, Pretty fun. You know, I really love this like high temperature cooking this time of year too. You get kind of browning on all these like really sweet ingredients. It smells amazing and the color. Balances things out. I mean, color, eat the rainbow. Yeah. As much color as you can get in there. And, you know, we're seeing on these test results, the less you have to cook it. Uh, I mean, the nutrient numbers just go down. I mean, my grandmother, when she used to cook you know, she'd put a pot of something on it and it would cook all day. Probably cooked every nutrient out of it by the time we ate it. Yeah, dumped it you down know, the and, drain. You know, this, I like this. It's what, three to four minutes? Quick. Boom, get a little browning, Pulling a little bit out. of edge on it. Keep the veg all the vegetables are still pretty firm when they come out. Be nice. That's good. Uh, Amazing. See, I'm ready to eat. Okay, good. And go back to work. You know, how many sandwiches will a home delivery box make? A bunch. <laughs> <laughs> well... A really a long ways. Yeah. 
Yeah, no, no kidding. Especially when you're, you know, you're cutting the vegetables. Yeah, it's, it's pretty amazing. All right, we're ready to go as well. You'll see I finished this with, uh, by adding the greens, the mustard greens, uh, some of the kale, some of these Asian greens. I just, let them, they don't take long to cook, so we just drop those to the pot. And we'll let some of that steam sort of soften them up. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. Yeah. I figured I would be like way, way, way ahead of you, but you bang that out pretty quick. Sure. I mean, you can do that at lunch if you want to. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I love that caramelization you've got on there. Yeah, let's You're going to get texture for sure. The crunchiness of the veg and then the greens. Yeah, I love that. Yeah, it's a meal. I mean, it's a lot. There, okay. you got to try my sandwich. You can't deal. It's messy. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Love that. Well, yeah, yeah. Who needs a ham? You know, I like I like my meat as well as anybody. But you get you get the hummus on there. You get the greens and and yeah, sure. you get the carrot or the bee down there, raw, you get that crunchiness. So you get kind of that meat texture that satiates you, you know? Yeah. It does it for you. Yeah. I'm loving that hot sauce too. It's mm -hmm. great. Like really good. The thing I like about this as much as anything, you know, you can eat this, you don't feel heavy. Mm. If I eat too heavy, I want to take a nap. Mm. This, I can eat this, go back to work, and it actually gives me energy. It doesn't drag me down. Right. And, right. It's just so important. <clears throat> Guys, don't let these boxes intimidate you. It's a little bit different, but even I can make something edible. <laughs> yeah. A bunch of times. Yeah. Can't wait. That's great. Uh, okay. Well, I'd enjoy. eat that. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Good day.